Hey guys, how's it going? Speed 3 Joe. Um, just want to do a quick video. So, not a big fan of the oil style filters. Um, I love the cob intake, love the velocity stack style um, housing they went with, well, as far as the math housing went. Math housing, sorry. Um, not a big fan of the oil filters. Uh, as you can see, like you can even see on my hand there, like it's not that I over oiled it. At least I don't think so. I mean, I'm usually pretty good at oiling these things, but. Even then, I mean, I live in the Northwest, and we get pretty good, pretty good amount of dust here. And uh, like you'll catch like during times where I'm changing it. Look, that's pretty good amount of oil. Um, during times where I'm changing it, you'll get like uh, leaves, and you know, during fall, you'll have leaves and dirt, debris all stuck in here. I know the better solution for that would be get the box, but uh, <laughs> I'm not really a guy of you know cosmetics. So but function for me is fine so um, I'm just trying to look up who uh, made a filter size that would you know fit this inlet here since it's a velocity stack I, like I said I like the most style like this I know JBR Cork Sport makes you know an intake with a dry dry fill filter already with it I not that I don't like that style I mean they, I'm pretty sure they all flow the same it's all the same thing but I just like the design of a velocity stack so I figured I could try to find something that would fit in here and I mean there's quite a bit of space so I mean I figured even a bigger filter would still fit even if you know I could get it over this inlet or this you know, velocity stack there anyways um, long story short guy on Instagram uh, forget his name um, I'll Shout him out in the description. Um, I seen a, a Instagram post of his his bay, and of course I seen that he had the carb intake, and I seen he had an AM drive flow, and I've been wanting to find a drive flow, but I could never figure out the size and the diameters or what's it gonna actually fit. Um, but I seen the guy on Instagram, he had the the drive flow filter on there, and you know I just commented asked what part number it was, or actually I didn't even ask the part number, I just asked what filter it was, and he threw me the part number, which actually happens to be. Uh, 2126 uh, or DK and you can either get that through AEM's website I did eBay because it's easier for me you know while I was on there I looked up you know of course AEM sells their their little filter guards or little splash guards for their filters but I actually found this one brand filter wares uh, I mean pretty legit little filter so I figured I'd give that one a try too might as well try to keep you know some of the debris off of it. Also, uh, just a quick walkthrough of what I have done. Of course, it's just uh, simple bolt-on, right? Nothing ridiculous. Um, Turbo Smart BPV, of course, Cobb SF intake, Cobb inlet, torque solutions, uh, boost couplers or tubes, whatever. Um, got a valve cap breathers, uh, breather cap, which I think is freaking dope, sick. Actually, one that in a giveaway. Valcoverbreeders.com. Check them out. They're cool. Of course, you have to get the color match blue. Um, cork support. Short throw. And then, of course, I have the cork support internals, right? Down, down. Cork support internals. Uh, cork support uh, bushings. Cobber mortar mount, <clears throat> and of course, it's Max Sport tuned by Dizzy Tuning. I have a 91, uh, 91 octane tune, and of course, I got an E30 tune. E30 actually, yeah, it's definitely a difference. <clears throat> I'll try to throw that boot on first, see how that goes. Uh, we'll see what that looks like on there first, and then we'll throw that on here. Hopefully, it's just a quick slip on, kind of a di little direct fit. We'll see.
thing. Like I said, I'm not a big fan of the oil style filter. Never had an issue necessarily with the oil clogging a map or anything, but just figured I'd get something different, try it out. Uh, like I said, gives it a good match between both those, that red and the I feel like if I didn't have this, it'd stand out and be like a really bright red, but definitely looks good. Can't complain. We'll see the difference. I don't think there'll be any difference, you know, as far as like flow. It should just flow exactly the same. But yeah, there's that. Just a quick little video on how to change from a cob oil style filter to an AM dry flow. Figured I'd make a video. Had it found on uh, anywhere on YouTube or anything, so figured I'd make a quick video. Alright, later.